Hi Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out who's thinking heavily about you right now and why. And please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me for Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius who's thinking heavily about Fire Signs right now and why. Three of Wands in reverse. High front. Ace of Swords in reverse. Ten of Wands in reverse. Seven of Swords. Will of Fortune. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Five of Cups in reverse. Page of Wands in reverse. And we've got the Hermit here in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so I feel like this is someone you've turned your back on with the Three of Wands in reverse, Ten of Wands in reverse, and Ace of Pentacles here. This may have been someone I feel you thought initially um, that maybe this connection could go far or that but it just didn't take off someone you've given up on because maybe there's just too much work or too burdensome mm, again roles can be reversed between you and whoever this person is for some of you fire signs there is someone okay this is very specific and it's just for some of you here if you have been connecting either in the past or currently with someone who is married or to someone who is in a very serious relationship right now. Uh, this person is thinking heavily about you right now. I'm saying that because of the Hierophant and the Seven of Swords and the Five Cups and Lovers. Um, that's just for some of you because the Hierophant can indicate marriage or being in a uh, very serious relationship with someone. The Seven of Swords indicates some sneakiness here. So for those of you, if you have been, again, connecting with someone who is married or is in a very serious relationship right now, or someone who is very bound at work, someone who has a high, very important or big responsibility, important role or, big res or that they have big responsibilities in their company, or it could be like someone who... Um, it's very restricted. That's what I'm getting here. So how fun can I get some sort of structure? So again, this part is very specific. It's just for some of you. Um, like they're being controlled, whether because of work, uh, some organization, um, or it could be like someone famous, you know, who doesn't want to be seen or known of your connection with them. Again, you know, that's for some of you only, okay? But... For the most of you, fire signs, it kind of feels like this is someone, for a lot of you, maybe this is someone you're not with right now, okay? You're separated from this person. It does feel like they could be spying on you, keeping tabs on you, right? They could be thinking heavily in regards of something important here because the high fun is something important. But also, it could indicate lessons being learned. So they could be also consulting friends, family, or um, if they go to a therapist, um, they could be thinking heavily in regards of what what these people have told them, right? Advise them in regards to you, in regards to this connection with you. And five of cups here in my verse, like wondering if there could be hope. For both of you to be with each other or to be with each other again okay if this is someone kind of new it kind of feels like they're delaying a lot of things here they're delaying a lot of things here this person is thinking heavily in regards of let me let me see that's what i'm getting so of swords can be someone a little bit selfish here as well this person could be somewhat selfish um, could also be thinking heavily in regards of 
a past connection that didn't work out, right? I'm starting to think heavily in regards of maybe there's some hope in regards to this connection. It could be some of you is someone you separated from. If you're separated from this person, they could be thinking heavily in regards of having some hope and faith of this connection that this connection could be different yeah uh, the reason why i'm saying that is because of the will of fortune here you can be thinking heavily in regards of maybe this connection could be different or if you're separated from this person they could be thinking heavily in regards of maybe things could be different if some things have changed or someone has changed they could also be thinking heavily in regards of you changing right maybe you've changed already Maybe that's due to you not really wanting to speak with them right now or page of ones and one first that you're not replying to the messages or replying to the messages very slowly. That's for some of you, but I feel like most likely for a lot of you, there's someone you're not talking, talking with right now. This person could be thinking about some lessons again that they may have learned from you, from this connection. Um... Definitely see them taking some lessons with them, Seven of Swords here. Through the separation, because of the separation. But if this is someone new again, Fire Sign, this person could be thinking heavily in regards of how, how maybe this is different. How maybe... Maybe from the way you speak with them, like you're different from the rest, or you just very different in some way shape or form oops sorry about that okay i'm gonna pull out more cards here hermit in reverse six of pentacles in reverse and three of pentacles in reverse feels like this is someone you may not think you may you may think that in order for this reconciliation to happen between the two of you something huge needs to change right something very big someone needs to move mountains in order for a reconciliation to happen between the two of you maybe this person was feeding another person maybe this person did lie to you and cheated on you in the past so if you do have someone was lied to you, cheated on you in the past. This person is thinking heavily about you right now. They could be thinking that you taught them a lesson by cutting them off, by not wanting to speak with them anymore, right? Hmm. This person we kind of lost as well at this moment, and I feel like they're not happy because the sun here is in reverse. For a lot of you fire signs, I feel like there's someone you're not with right now. Okay. This person could be a Virgo, could be a Taurus, could be a fire sign. Again, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius can be any sign. Let's see more here. So we've got the Nine of Wands in reverse, Nine of Cups in reverse, and Nine of Pentacles here. Hmm, this person will be thinking heavily in regards of you being single. Uh, or that they're not happy being single right now um, after the separation. If you're separated from this person, they're not happy being single. Uh, or that they're not happy seeing you doing well for yourself and you're successful on your way to success and that you're independent. They may feel a little bit rejected here with the Nine of Cups in my first. Or this person may have rejected you in the past. This person could have taught you a lesson where you need where you could be feeling the need to be independent or this person could have led you to believe that being single would be better than being with them, okay? Not on ones of a verse. Feels like for a lot of you, this is someone you're no longer fighting for. You're, you're not very happy with this person. But again, it could go vice versa here, right? This person could also be thinking heavily in regards of the way you look. Nine of Pentacles, how you always have high standards, um, just the way you are, you know. Mm, how gorgeous you are. Nine of Pentacles is a gorgeous energy for me as well. For some reason, they think heavily about that, but they're not too happy about that. How maybe you could have held your own. You could have done things your 
own way um, as if you don't need them, right? Alright, fire signs. Leo, Aries, and Sag, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. I'll leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics, different questions. Check it out too if you want to. And I hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Take care, fire signs. Bye.